Hey, yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Keed and welcome back to another video I hope you guys all are having a spontaneous day today If you're not hopefully I'll be able to make your day a little bit better because earlier today I was talking to my boy Paul the monkey and he hooked us up with a crazy deal Basically, he said for everyone who likes this video He will give you a free coupon that entitles you to one free anything Basically, this is like the best coupon ever and it's redeemable anywhere You can get a free Lambo if you want or a free house or heck even if you want you can get a free free coupon with your free coupon if you want like our boy Paul really hooked us up here so to get your coupon just like the video and Paul the monkey will actually show up to your house and give it to you for free but anywho earlier today I was laying in my bed watching YouTube like you do when this old BuzzFeed video popped up in my recommended and it was a video titled adult children take a lie detector test with parents and honestly it just seemed like a really weird video so without further ado grab your lies grab your detectors and grab your polygraph because today we are taking a lie detector test. Not true. Gary, I'm sorry, I'm glad to hear you. Oh, I'm not expecting it. <laughs> Jesus, this is super intense. Like, why are they making this such a dramatic moment? They're just getting hooked up to a lie detector test. It's portrayed like they're getting hooked up to like an electric chair instead, and this is like the end for them. I mean, it might be the end for them regardless, because they're getting hooked up to a machine where they can't get away with lying about anything to their parents. That is insane. Their parents can literally get them to fess up to anything. Like, why would you sign up for this? Adam? Have you ever skipped school? Yeah. He's telling the truth. Did you do this in high school? Yeah. He's telling the truth. Why do you care if your kid skipped school like three years ago? Is that seriously still a concern for you? Why does it matter if your child skipped school back when he was in high school now? Like, you can't do anything to change that. That's a problem from the way past. First question, I'm gonna keep it simple. Have you been drinking enough water? Yes. He's telling the truth. How can a lie detector show if you drink enough water or not? Like, how can a lie detector show if you drink enough water or not? Like, it doesn't have magical powers that just know if you're doing things well or not. It's just gonna show if the person who's hooked up to the test thinks they're doing things well. So this guy thinks he's drinking enough water, but maybe he's only drinking like a half a cup of water a day and he thinks that a half a cup of water is enough water. So like, he could actually not be drinking enough water at all. I don't know why this guy's mother thought that that was a good question whatsoever to ask but whatever i guess have you ever hung out with someone that i, I didn't like what one that I, I didn't like that you um you had yes true who was the guy well there are some rebels and then you told me not to hang out with bad people and they happen to be smoking the marijuana and the marijuana yeah. And they offered me some and I said, no, thank you. Say no to drugs, kids, because you never know when your parents are going to go onto a BuzzFeed video and have you hooked up to a lie detector test and ask you if you've done drugs. This girl has been preparing for this moment her whole life. That's why she said no thank you to those scary people who offered her drugs, just because she knew she was going to be in a BuzzFeed video. When I asked you to do something for me and you told me you needed the money to pay a bill, did you spend that money? On a bill? Yes. Not true. Mm, mm. <laughs> Okay, but like that just looks worse than what it probably was like it would show up as a lie Even if your mom gave you like a hundred bucks to pay a bill and you only spent a dollar of it on candy because the bill was only $99 like that just looks like he's stealing money from his mom Which more than likely just simply isn't the case. Have you taken any illegal substances within the last two weeks? No He's lying. No way. <laughs> he's lying <laughs> when I asked you to reorganize the garage. They happen to be Halloween costumes that you really, 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 really liked. Did you take them? All the other parents are just asking the usual questions like, do you do drugs and stuff like that? This mom is getting into very, very specific questions and holding grudges on things that really don't matter at all. Like, so what if your son took some old Halloween costumes from your attic? Is that really that much of a concern to you? Did you quit your job or did you get fired? I quit. Doing bad. 
Why does this dude even try to lie while hooked up to this test? Like, there's no point in even trying. This dude's just gonna give you a solid thumbs down anytime you lie. Not true. I don't know about you guys, but when I was a kid and I got caught lying, my mom would always say that God knows when I'm lying, so I shouldn't lie. And I feel like this dude is like God. <laughs> he just knows every time. Do you have sex with friend of yours? No. <laughs> What? Why would a parent want to know that about their kid? That's like super weird. True. Why not, Stephanie? <laughs> what? Why does this parent want to know if her kid did the dirty with someone? Like, no, that's so freaking odd. Like I said earlier, this mom is just holding these super weird grudges of super very, very specific scenarios of things. I've really been wanting to ask you this for a long time too. I'm nervous. When I baked cookies for your sister's birthday party, literally, Half of them came up missing that your cousin Mike came over and ate them. But I never saw Mike come in ever. Did you? Eat those cookies. <laughs> like I said earlier, this mom is just holding all these super weird grudges of very, very specific scenarios of things that have no significance whatsoever. Like, what's the next question? Uh, okay, son, so do you remember 14 years ago we were at Disney World and we just got off Space Mountain and we were walking and then you stopped real quick to look over at something and you told me you saw a butterfly, but I didn't see a butterfly. Um, anyway, my question was, was that actually a butterfly that you were looking at or were you looking at mickey mouse and you were just too embarrassed to say it um mom i was five then have you had any sexual relations yes why do parents want to know so bad if their children are virgins or not like that's not something that your parent needs to know at all <laughs> true was any of this unprotected by any chance mm, yeah he's telling the truth oh great <laughs> Mom's gonna love this. Oh no, she's not. Oh yes, she is. Oh yes, I can't wait to go home and tell my wife that our son isn't a virgin and doesn't use condoms. Like, dude, what? Is this even real at this point? Like, are these questions BuzzFeed made the parents ask? Or was this dad genuinely curious if his son was a virgin or not? Have you ever uh, had any relations with a porn star? No. True. Have you ever spoken to a porn star? Yeah. Why did this dad just tweak at the fact that his son has spoken to an adult film star before? Also, why do you care if he did or didn't? Like, why is that a question you ask your son? Are you dating now? No. Mmm. Yeah. Having a tough time. <laughs> what? Didn't even cross my mind. What's up with all these weird edits? Like, are these edits really on par for a huge channel like BuzzFeed? Throughout the whole video, there's just been a ton of weird, unusual edits the whole time. I, I just don't get it. So today, we just finished the lie detector test with my stepson, Roland. Found out some uh, very interesting things about my son. Yeah, um, I found out a lot about my son. For some reason, I just really, really want to know about my son's sex life, but that's besides the point. I feel like me and my son are closer now since I know he's not a virgin. Like, what? He actually has had uh, some kind of conversation with a porn star that I didn't know about. This should be very interesting to hear more about as we drive home. It was a great experience because we know each other, but with this test, it comes out great. I uh, respect him and, and uh, hope he respects me too. I respect you, Dad. Come here. Stop lying. This video was honestly super weird. I don't know why parents want to know some specific things about their kids so much. Like, I honestly find it very weird. Like, if I had a kid, I wouldn't ask him if he was a virgin or not. Like, I could care less about that. I'd actually prefer not to know that. But anyways, guys, that's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching today's video until the end. It really does help me out so much, and I appreciate it a lot. You guys are the real Gs for that. Don't forget to leave a big fat thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, ring that bell to receive all notifications so you never miss an upload and one more thing as a lot of you guys know i was doing daily uploads for a while and recently i've been slacking a little bit i'm not gonna lie and that's just due to my new work schedule so i'm trying my hardest to get some videos ready and get my regular upload schedule back but until then please make sure you've clicked my bell so you get notified when i upload because my schedule is probably gonna be a little bit off for the next week or two but anyways guys this has been keyed and i'll see you all in the next video peace 
Ah, yeah, Pete has a D to keep it real. Swallow the pill, show me the thrill. Follow the dream to keep it silly. Grind on the daily just to stay up late. Money is great, but the fans are what makes it okay. He wants a smile on your face, never see a frown. And on the rainy days, he'll keep on grinding till he makes his place in the world full of fakes. Get the shit out his face, it'll be okay. If you don't.